Nvidia just officially launched the RGX 5050, so what's really going on here? The RGX 5050 desktop GPU starts at $249. You get the new GB207 chip maxed out, 2560 CUDA cores, 80 Tensor, 20 Ray Tracing cores, and 8GB of GDDR6 on a 128-bit bus. So the GDDR6 isn't really anything fancy. But clocks hit 2.31GHz base, 2.57GHz boost. When it comes to power draw, you have 130 watts, usually with an 8-pin connector. It's designed for 1080p gaming with DLSS4 and ray tracing on medium to high settings. The RTX 5050 laptop, on the other hand, starts at $999 and it features the same core count, 2560 CUDA but with 8GB of GDDR7 which is faster and more power efficient. It runs cooler and fits in thin and light models, just 15mm thick and 286 pounds. This is perfect for gamers or students on the move. Now, NVIDIA says desktop 5050 is 60% faster than the 3050 in regular games and 4 times faster with DLSS 4. Laptops about 2.4% faster than the 3050 laptop in raster and over 4 times with DLSS enhancements. But keep in mind that's under ideal conditions using NVIDIA's own benchmarks, so take it with a grain of salt. Bottom line, if you're on a GTX 1650 or older, this might be the upgrade you've been waiting for. Just be sure to wait for real-world benchmarks first.